Fighters fight for many different reasons. Some do it for the fame, others do it for the money. Eventually, all of that fades away. Yet going down in the history books as a UFC champion is something no one can ever take. It's proof that for a moment in time, out of all the fighters in your weight class, you were the best in the world. It's the culmination of all your hard work, the fulfillment of a dream. Tonight is your chance to take that gold belt and hear Bruce Buffer say, and new. That kind of glory lasts forever. Coming up next, it's a lightweight championship. And now our tale of the tape for this lightweight fight. Both fighters are 34. McGregor will have a four inch reach advantage. All right, now for the particulars, here's Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. And when the action begins, our referee in charge, Mario Yamazaki. And now, this is the moment you've all been waiting for. Live from the sold out United Center in Chicago, Illinois. It's time! Five rounds for the undisputed UFC Lightweight Championship of the World. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner. This man is a kickboxer, holding a professional record on. 20 wins, no losses. He stands 5 feet 9 inches tall, weighing in at 155 pounds. Fighting out of Dublin, Ireland, introducing the challenger, the notorious Connor McGregor! Here we go, first round, you ready? You ready? All right, here we go. Will we crown a new UFC lightweight champion here tonight? It is time to find out. All right, so will we get a new champion here tonight? That remains to be seen. Round one is underway. This fight, five minutes or fewer for the UFC lightweight championship. For the number one contender, this is his first championship opportunity. And given the depth at 155 pounds, you may not get another one. We'll see if he is urgent early as he tries to wrest away the belt. Pretty good work with the strikes here off of his back by McGregor. All right, first round is underway, and I don't have to tell the Abbott fans, you've got to watch out for this fighter's powerful overhand punches. He does not discriminate power from both sides, and a big part of his game plan, obviously, coming in here tonight. Excellent movement on the ground here, always trying to better his position. Postures up. Oh, and he lands a brutal strike to the head. All right, so he just decides to get up here, Joe. A huge leg kick. Oh! oh. He got tagged. He's got him up here. Yeah. Under three minutes now to go in what has been a very fast-paced opening round here. They clinch up here, and they move out of the clinch. Nice kick by the champ. Stuffs the takedown, no problem. McGregor gets the takedown, could be big here. And he connects there. Huge shots raining down. He's out! He's out! a great sign of an intelligent fighter. Composure. Knew he hurt him, and he's taking his time. 
Well, that's the way they used to ground and pound fighters back in the day, literally trying to pound your opponent's head through the canvas. Elbows and strikes and hammer fists one after the next, an offensive explosion on the ground that gets him the knockout win here tonight. Let's take a look at that again. And here it is again. Boom. And there is the UFC lightweight champion. He is going to be a hard guy to buck off the throne, getting it done by way of knockout here tonight. What a finish on the sport's biggest stage. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Nari Yamasaki is called to stop to this contest at three minutes, nine seconds of the very first round. Declaring the winner by knockout. So some UFC history tonight as we crown a new UFC champion. Congratulations to fighter and team. And man, are they going to enjoy this one. A lot of people not giving them a chance coming in here tonight. And this is a moment that at times people just thought we wouldn't see. New champion here tonight. The longtime incumbent is out. There is a new sheriff in town in this division. And it is going to take a big performance to dethrone the new champion of this weight class. Every second bitch, I got to use it. Sign with a fluid and I can't go to the microphone and I make a lose it. And I make jump in the back.